Hi, I'm Tamir from Caddy Brothers, and in this video I will show you how to set up and use the menu on one of our 7-inch mirror monitors. SKU number on Caddy Brothers is SKU22503. For this video, I'm using the clip-on version of the mirror, but it's also available on a full as a full mirror replacement. Depends on what your preference is. Before I get into the nitty-gritty, I just wanted to remind you guys that we strongly recommend you bench chest everything. It gives you a better understanding of how the system works, and it'll make the installation cleaner, and most times it'll make it even quicker. So here's what we're going to do. The first part is we have to connect the harness that comes with the monitor to the monitor itself. So we're going to take this part here, and we're going to line up the two arrows right here like this. And we're going to connect it right here like that. When you hear the click, you're there. Then we're going to take the mirror itself, plug it into 12 volts. You see here, you get the red and the black. The red goes to the positive, and the black goes to the negative. Once we do that, the mirror should power up. We're on AV2. This tells you the AVDR, and we have no signal. Before I fix that for you, I wanted you guys to see the no signal. That doesn't mean that it's not working. That means that the monitor is not getting a image from the camera, which could be caused because there's no power to the camera, or the transmitter's off on the camera, or the receiver's off. There's different things. This just means that it's not getting an image, or what a lot of times happens, you are on the wrong input. Like that. See, now I moved to AV1. In this case, I didn't plug the camera in because we're just setting it up. So I'm just going to take the camera right here plug it in, move to the other video, and there you go. We have an image right here. All right, there you go. Right there we got the image. All right, now before we move on, anything that you see me do here with the menu itself can be done with the included remote control. Just a matter of preference. A lot of times when that mirror is all the way up there, it's easier to use the remote control. Just remember to remove the little plastic thing so that it gets activated. All right, so as for the menu itself, to enter the menu, you click on the M button that you see here, like that. And now we're going to see the brightness. You can toggle with, with the arrows up and down on all the options of the menu. We're going to go to the contrast, then you have saturation, the tint, which is very important, the language. Got a bunch of languages here. Um, then you have this, the mode of the, the screen itself. That's the aspect ratio. That you see there depending on the camera that you have it's up to you how you want to use it then we have rotate screen what that does is it lets you rotate the image itself so if you want the image upside down you can do that but also if you have a camera that's meant to go on the back of the vehicle and you want to put it on the front this will help you mirror reverse mirror the image it gives you a lot of options a lot of different ways to do it you can also flip it and do reverse image it really gives you a lot of customizability in the system itself then after you can rotate it, the last option here is if you really kind of messed it up, you have a reset, brings everything to the default state as if it's a brand new mirror. So we recommend playing with it when you get it. You're not going to ruin it. You're not going to break it. Just play with it until you get the better understanding of how it works. Uh, finally, again, we have the remote right here, which allows you to do everything that you saw me do on the mirror itself. This system will, uh, is very popular with our truck systems or even RVs when you put a fifth wheel in there so you have a camera on the license plate and a camera in the back of the vehicle. Here are a couple of systems that are really popular that have the mirror. When you get it, you can customize the cameras however you like, but these are the, the top most popular systems that we have that use this type of mirror. If you upgrade to a 9-inch or some kind of bigger monitor, the concept is the same and the menu is the same. So you have nothing to worry about if this looks a little different than what you ordered or upgraded to. If you have any questions or you need any more tech support, please don't hesitate to call us at 866-966-5550. From all of us here at Taddy Brothers, thanks for watching and have a great day.